Ladies and gentlemen, would you please stand? may be seated. You guys can face one another. Well, on behalf of Daniel and Molly, I want to certainly thank all of you for being here. They extend their thanks for you being here, the effort, the expense, and the time for you to be here today on their special day and playing a part in their journey. All of you have been a part of that, whether you've been an encouragement, a friend, a family member, and certainly today, you're an encouragement by being here to support them. So thank you so much. And I would ask you to bow your heads and let's start the service with a prayer and ask the Lord to bless them and keep them all the days that they'll live together. Dear God, thank you so much for relationships. Thank you for marriage. Thank you for Daniel and Molly. Thank you for the love they share toward one another. And we pray that today as we bear witness of their marriage, that you would keep them strong and you would help them uh, through their entire marriage, bless them in ways that they can't even imagine. And we pray now that you would bless this service and lead us in the name of Christ. Amen. Daniel, you'll just respond to I do to the intent of the service today. So do you, Daniel? Do you take Molly to be your lawfully wedded wife, to have and to hold in sickness and in health, in good times and not so good times, for richer, poor, keeping yourself for her as long as you both shall live? I do. Molly, do you take Daniel to be your lawfully wedded husband? to have and hold in sickness and health, good times, not so good times, for richer, for poor, keeping yourself unto him as long as you both shall live. I do. I do. Let's bow and have a prayer. Father, we thank you for this declaration of intent today and for their hearts. And we pray that you'll give them the strength and the ability and the vision to keep that all the days of their life that we pray in Christ's holy name. Amen. Dan and Molly have written their vows toward one another, so I'm going to ask each one of them to take their vows. And Daniel, you're going to go first. That's fine. And you're going to express your vows and commitment to Molly. Sure, uh, sure I have to go first. Yeah. All right. Hi, everybody. I'm Hopefully I'll talk loud enough so everybody can hear me. Molly, we finally have made it to the wedding. It feels so surreal to be standing here with the love of my life, my partner through everything, as well as my best friend. Life has a funny way of working out, and you have helped me. Remi you have helped remind me that it does always work out. So thank you. I'm so glad that our paths crossed down in Hilton Head. Shout out to Circle K. Thank you for sending me down to Hilton Head. Um, and I feel so lucky to have you in my corner. You make me a better person and you inspire me 
by bringing out the best version of myself, and I will always be grateful in that. Molly, I promise to love you, to care for you, and to protect you through all. I promise to make you feel special each and every day. I promise to always put God at the center of our relationship. I promise to be the best husband, the best cat dad to beans, nacho, and queso, which they couldn't make the wedding, but I brought them <laughs> via my socks, which is our three cats. And I will never forget your Polynesian sauce at Chick-fil-A as well. <laughs> I will never stop loving you, cherishing you, or enjoying the time with you, my love. I feel so honored to be here today, and I love you with all my heart. Daniel Scott Jones, I know that God created you specifically for me. I love you more than words can describe. You are my soulmate, my person, and my best friend. You are my everything. Everything I didn't know I was dreaming of. Everything I was told to wait for. Everything I could possibly love. You are my every day, every moment, and every memory I want to fill my life with. I could talk forever about everything that I love about you. I praise God because he has given me you and I admire you for so many reasons. You are worth more to me than anything this world could offer. I promise to always support you and be there for you through good times and bad. I promise to always put God first in our relationship and to pray with you every day. I vow to stand with you when the struggles of life weigh you down and celebrate with you when life brings us joy. I vow to laugh with you and at you every day. <laughs> Lastly, I promise to let you watch at least one sporting event a day. <laughs> yes. You are the man that I have prayed for my entire life. I choose you today and every day. I love you, Dan. Well, as they express their vows to one another, I know that each of them have brought your gift of a ring. And so, Daniel, I'm going to ask you first if you would get that ring. There it is. And if you would place that on Molly's finger, please. And as you have expressed your vows to one another and your commitment to one another, this ring will forever be a signal and a symbol on your hand of your ever love for one another. Okay, so Daniel, if you would re please repeat after me. So Molly, I give you this ring. Molly, I give you this ring. As a symbol of my love. As a symbol of my love. With a pledge. With a pledge. To love you today. To love you today. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. And always. And always. And forever. And forever. And Molly, I know that you likewise have a ring for Daniel to express your commitment and vow to him. If you'll place that on his finger please and Molly you will do just the same you'll repeat after me Daniel I give you this ring Daniel I give you this ring a symbol of my love a symbol of my love with a pledge with a pledge to love you today to love you today and tomorrow and tomorrow and always and always and forever and forever now it is before these witnesses and before God Almighty today and through this service and this wedding ceremony that you pledged your love toward one another. And because of that and the power invested in me by the state of South Carolina, I can pronounce you husband and wife. And so Daniel, for the very first time as a husband, you may kiss your bride. Well, I can't present to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Daniel Jones.